need to look further than your own college campus for nutritious and delicious meals and goodies. Here at Santa Rosa Junior College, the public has access to restaurant quality meals and baked goods made by students in the culinary arts program. I observe the students as they um, uh, serve the guests. Are they serving properly open-handed? Are they doing well with their time management? Um, are they able to greet guests in the amount of time we want them to greet them when they're first seated? In other words, um, I watch them all day long. I'm seating guests in the dining room. I'm taking care of guests, but my main job is to take care of my students so that I'm guiding them and coaching them and helping them along as they are meeting with a different customer you know every few minutes we have the luxury of having an environment that is very oriented towards teaching and learning it's not oriented towards we have to get as many customers in here and make as much money as possible our primary goal is to help the students gain skills and perfect those skills so that they're well equipped when they go out into the real world and get a job the menu changes weekly and students learn these dishes in class and then prepare them when the cafe is open. Food is locally sourced. Many of the vegetables and grass-fed beef used in the dishes are products of Schoen Farm located in Forestville. Additionally, for guests over age 21, Schoen Farm wines are available. Guests have two options when dining at the cafe. They can be seated in the main dining room for a traditional restaurant experience or order takeout from the bakery. Additionally, the bakery offers a wide variety of freshly baked bread and desserts. To really progress the most in the program, the best choice in my opinion is to do every aspect of it. You have to do the baking program, the front of house operations, the culinary, so the savory cooking in the cafe. Every chef you ask will try to like push you to do it all. They're like, oh yeah, just take production. It's so fun, it's so easy, and it'll be so worth it at the end. I mean, why not be the best you can be coming out of school? There's really no other option. Now the culinary students get here at 7.30 a.m. and they meet with the chef instructor and the chef instructor goes over the details of the day. And then they will adjourn to the kitchen where they will have been given assignments for prep work. So they'll be prepping then, generally from about 7.45 in the morning right up until 11.30 when we open for lunch. Just as the kitchen students are setting up the kitchen, the dining room students are setting up the dining room to get ready for service. I think it's really fun. I love the whole rush of it all. It's like at the end of the day and you're like, oh, how was your day? They're like, oh, you know, it was working in the kitchen. And that's just the answer because everyone knows that it's stressful, but it's totally worth it at the end of the day just because of how much you love what you're doing. So the next time you leave class hungry and tired of Taco Bell and Mambo's, stop by the delicious JC Culinary Cafe located right across from the main SRJC sign on Mendocino Avenue to support your fellow classmates.